The FBI warned this week about a new cyber attack too as well. Cyber attack bullying going on. So that's coming up too as well. So we're going to monitor that. I've already been attacked by three people already on Facebook already. And, you know, I'm, I'm waiting to be, uh, I'm waiting for uh, Facebook to actually give me a claim for my, for the work that I've done because I actually did the work of Facebook security. I did the work for them. So, um, I need I need to get revenue going here for that. I need to get paid for my service. Well, there's a lot of us I'm in the between different things too. Uh, what's going on? Uh, mm -hmm. By the way, Oprah uh, said that many Americans uh, disrespect Obama because of, uh, he's African American. Right. The race card again because he's the pool ranks down about thirty six percent. You know, and uh, MSNBC breaking news. MSNBC. Uh, suspended and uh, fired Alec Baldwin, uh, Alec Baldwin and his TV show. Oh, good. Plus, it was racially wrong. Yay! One bonehead off the air. Wonderful. Let's do it. Let's get Chris Matthews next and Rachel Meow. <laughs> you know, and, um, you know, it, okay, also good news is that Charles Barkley, who I do with my black friends, is not up to white Americans. But he also said that black people are responsible, are more responsible to attack by the blacks. Mm. Talking about the breakup of the uh, family entity in, uh, in, the, uh, in the black community and the lack of education. Mm -hmm. uh, there's some of the people waking up. Well, that's good. I'm glad they are because we need, we need to be woken up, you know. We got to, you know. We have to, we got to shake things up. That's what, that's what um, Sarah Palin said, you know, back in 2011. We got to shake them up. And, um, uh, the, you know, the Toronto crack mayor apologizes again. Got stripped of powers. But huh. this guy here in Toronto, the mayor. Uh, right. Yeah, he's been taking crack and everything else. He's very... He, Got a pool of ratings higher than the Obamas. This is the 40s, Obamas in the 30s. <laughs> so, uh, um, That's funny. So, uh, one of the uh, guys, Scott Blue, said, uh, oh, uh, it was uh, James Caldwell, said that Obamas should smoke, we better smoke crack. Right. Because the pool of ratings will go up. All right, also, um, speaking of Obamacare, did you know um, when the, when the, what, well, this is from, uh, uh, this is from Re uh, Regis from Wheel of Fortune. He posted up on Twitter. Did you see that today? He posted up that uh, with Obamacare, the being web, the website being up. Okay, I I can sell I can sell you ice and hell with a new ice skating ring. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So. Yeah. That gives you an idea how um, celebrities are also mad with with Obama too as well. Yeah, well, he's, they're, they're kind of walking away a little bit. Yeah, he's losing a lot of his Hollywood stuff, but you know, it's he's having a lot of gold. Well, he lied to American people. I mean, he, he even did it. You know, he he did it publicly in two thousand nine. He said, "I will not." You know, if you like your can, if you like your plan, you can keep your plan. Well, guess what? That's not the case anymore. By yeah. the way, uh, in 20, next year, 90 million uh, medical insurance plans will work this hard dump in uh, two ACA exams and streets, and 90 million lose doctors to pay. Uh, you know, it's, it's going to be really, you think it's bad now, wait. But the biggest thing that's going on right now on Twitter is uh, is Alec Baldwin's uh, suspension. That's good. That's good. So that's, at least that's one bonehead off the air. That's great. So we could hopefully do some more. Um, and what else do you want to talk about too as well? Let's see. Oh yeah, we want to mention too that with Obamacare. This is a violation of the oath of office to trust the American people. There's no trust anymore. It's, he, what constitution? Uh, basically, he's, he's a dictator in charge. 
Right. This is something that we need to uh, keep. That's why it's important to not only focus on the bulk, yeah, but focus on the fact that he's circumventing Congress, he's violating the Constitution, and things he's been doing first, the, uh, the, um, the delay on the, on the, uh, uh, the employer mandate for one year delay that uh, he did that on his own, which is right. And now, and now he's doing what he's doing with this one, which is illegal. Mm-hmm. Uh, come on, people! You know, he, he, unless you start standing up to this guy, he's a dictator. He's taking, he's grabbing power left and right. Right. He's also fired over two hundred generals and admirals and other high echelon military personnel. Uh, you know, he's. He is uh, basically consolidating power, and unless you start standing up to him, we may have problems. Right. One thing, too, we want to...